yeah, this guy, Marco Diaz, which is a name you might recognize. It's a character from Star vs. the Forces of Evil. Uh, this guy claims that he is the real Marco Diaz. Red patent pumps, squeaky toe wiggling shoes, boots, please hexide obsession with shoes, princess girls, and princess peach, and princess daisy, and Rosalina, and Pauline, and all girls Nintendo characters, beautiful shoes, fan please to touch his modify shoes, please princess daisy, please yes, please t see more. And, uh, yeah, he's got red patent pump squeaky toe wiggling shoes boots play. Um, and he does this. This is his fetish, I guess. Uh, putting his hand over shoes is very specific. It's not a foot fetish as such. I mean, I, I guess it is. It's a, it is, t it is, it is like, it is like an, an FF, like, job upgrade from a foot fetish. It's, it's a, it's a specialization of foot fetish. It's specifically shoes, and more specifically, uh, little kids, uh, wearing shoes. Uh, let me see here. What else do we have? Uh, well, we have this. This is some of his, I guess, art. I really don't know what you would call this. But, uh, you know, this is him in the bottom right there. That's him uh, with the with the foofy hair. Uh, he's making like a shiggy diggy face in the green shirt there. Um, yeah, he does this art, I guess you could call it, which is very, uh, very, uh, what, what's the word? Very Pooh's Adventures uh, art, I, I would say. Very... Very Pooh's Adventures reminiscent. Uh, at Queen Edgar Neri Changeling with Amy, Sonic, and the Joker and Harley Quinn. Uh, I guess this is Vine Wrestle 2022. I'm very excited. Um, but yeah, he does that sort of thing. Uh, he is also uh, known to the police. Let's read a little bit of a thing here. This is a plea for assistance from somebody. And it's worth noting, as you can see here, uh, he covers up certain names and certain, like, groups with, like, MLP Equestria or whatever. Uh, in, in the next image, he... Hang on, what does that say? There you go. Um, he, uh, in the next image, he, he has a whole thing about it's it's an email back from the police. Uh, this is an email from someone in his community to the pol to the LAPD. Hello, I'm a member of NLT Equestria community. I wanted to send this email first and then try calling tomorrow so you can see my attachments. My community and I have been dealing with an individual who may live in Panorama City. He is taking our photos and cropping them just to show up to show just our feet and posting them to multiple accounts online. Our community has minors in it, and we do not want exposed to his foot fetish. We believe his name is Edgar Neri. He goes. Uh, he also goes as a few other names like Edgar Neri. For some reason, he he replaced whatever this is, whatever the second version of his name is. There, he replaced whatever was originally said with his actual name again. Uh, upon having to block some of these accounts that he keeps making, we realized that he one possibly made his address public, and two, he has a photo of him touching the feet of what looks like a minor. It was uh, also brought to our attention that he may have some kind of, sub I like that, kind apostrophe V-E. That's, that's good. What does that say? Put that over here for now. Uh, some kind of severe mental handicap, and his parents slash caretaker do not realize what he is doing online. We were wondering if some kind of welfare check could be done to inform his guardians of his behavior before he gets into trouble and to get him to leave us and our community alone. I've attached several photos to this email. One contains his address, one where he lists on his profile that he is a, quote, pedophile, a screenshot of proof uh, he's taking our pictures and a photo of the minor in which he's touching the feet of. That's a good, that's a, that's how you construct a sentence right there. Uh, all these are proof he is using multiple accounts with different names. Thank you for your time. And of course, the timeless response from the police, the, a the excellent response from the police. Uh, you need to contact your local guard. But as a general rule, there's no expectation of privacy when out in public. 
And that's the entire response to that whole thing. Eh, you know, whatever. Fuck it. Eh, don't worry about it. The, the First Amendment or something. I don't know. Fuck you. Get get lost. And it's signed Princess Twilight Sparkle, Princess Luna, Princess Candace, the Royal Guard Pony Department, Princess Celestia. I think he used to like ponies and now he like hates them or something. I'm not really sure. But yeah, the police don't seem to give a shit. So uh, so there's that. Um, let's uh, let's take a look at some of his videos real quick, because, you know, we've seen we've seen all of that. Uh, we, we've seen his uh, some of his greatest hits there. Let's let's take a look at some of his YouTube stuff here. Uh, if his channel still exists, this guy likes to delete his channels, change the names of his channels private them uh, twitter accounts too private them uh, all sorts of things so if uh, if we manage to see all of the stuff that we're trying to see here it'll be it'll be a good time um but uh here oh that's not the one let me find let me find the really good one is it this uh, yeah i think it's this account um there's a specific one that's like a pretty decent video to to demonstrate this guy um, it's this one here. Uh, let me, boop, boop. and I am real Marco Diaz. I'm real voice Marco Diaz actor. I'm 25 years old. I'm born June 12th, 1995. Uh, so this guy is an adult and, uh, well, hello. My Hello. name is Marco Diaz. Well, like, I have to look one thing. My, it's my voice. It's better than after. Oh, wait, wait. If it's that voice, it's me, like Marco. And it's Marco Diaz. Well, and it happened. Wait, what is it supposing, like me? Wait, well, it was, it supposing I did it was. Would it, would it be true that I'd be... I think he's talking to himself here. He's like, I did, I was. He's like responding to his own like voices in his head or something. Uh, oh no, it's like, oh no. And it, oh no. Wait, wait, wait like, oh no. Hi, my name's Marco. It was like me. I think it wasn't even true. Well, I think... So I'm not sure, uh... You know, the the question comes to mind, is this okay? <laughs> or should we should we be watching this really uh right now? But don't you worry, don't you worry about that because uh let me just uh you know, let's 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 get everybody back up to speed here with who this gentleman is af after all. Uh this is Marco Diaz pedophile with shoes boots mlp equestria girls and mlp equestria all pony girls people equestria ponyville and can't cantalote girls beautiful shoes fan please to touch his modify shoes boots please twilight sparkle and equestria girls please yes please to candid wiggle wiggling pop popping up to rubbing toes feet flats all over you are bottomed feet shoes please and uh yeah you know he just just calls himself a pedo right there. That's not the only time he does. Here's another picture from him. I don't I don't even know what this is trying to say. This this looks like a this looks like a post from that Timic guy that we had to the the new world order gentleman. Um but yeah, you know, this is this this proves it. I don't know what it's proven, but it proves it, I'm sure. Um so yeah, that's Marco Diaz. Let me take a look here. So that's this video. There's nothing more to be seen really in that video. Uh, here we have him touching a child's feet. And that's all you're going to get of that video. I'm not showing any more of that. Uh, but yes, he has access to children. I'm not sure what his living situation is. I don't know if maybe that's his sister. Uh, you know, niece. I don't know. Uh, we get precious few looks into his, like, life, but, you know, this, this weird, like, clutching of the foot is very strange. I guess he likes the feeling of the toes wiggling inside the shoe, but 
I don't know. Not a not a fan. Not a fan of that. Uh, not a fan of that. Uh, I got new red hoodie. From what I understand, the character Marco Diaz from the Star Show uh, wears like a red hoodie. So I guess he's trying his best to cosplay as the character that he uh, is, or, or something. Oh, hey, princess! I got something new. The new is... Hey, Discord kitten! I got something new! The new is... The red hoodie! The red hoodie! Wait, what do you think? It looks like a real hoodie. Yeah, It, it does look a like hoodie. a real hoodie, yes. Uh, I fix fix his hair again, but... Oh, I was doing it fine. Uh, well, this raises the obvious question. I see people in chat getting understandably upset uh, with what they've seen here. But obviously this guy is not in control of his faculties, uh, as I said before. He's got something wrong with him. I don't know exactly what it is. Uh, we had a theory that maybe this is all he's just faking. Uh, as they say, he's just pretending to be retarded. <laughs> but uh, he's got channels dating back to like 2013, or rather YouTube, uh, rather Twitter accounts, not, not YouTube channels. Uh, dating back to at least 2013, so it's pretty long con if that's the if that's the uh, that's the answer. So I don't think that's what it is. I think he is this way, but there's a couple of little flashes of something going on with him. Um, I don't know if we'll see it, but well, you know, I think we will see it. I I won't spoil the surprise uh, for for you. I won't. Uh, I I won't. Uh, hang on. I won't spoil the surprise. I'm not gonna spoil anything. It's nice. And a red hoodie! Look at this! It's a red hoodie! He's well regarded, I'm yes. He's it. very regarded. That looks kinda awesome. There's a red hoodie. And it really looks good. Thank you so much, Princess. I am the real Marco Diaz. And I zip around to. The person in chat says they have like a deep rooted moral issue with making fun of people like this. And ordinarily, I think I would agree with you to some extent. I mean, you know, obviously Chris Chan and people like that. A lot of the people we look at on this channel probably have something wrong with them. But, you know, when when someone is as far gone as this guy, I wouldn't normally even talk about him. But this guy appears to be a bit of a danger to at least others, possibly himself. And it really does make you ask yourself the question of like, OK, well, this guy's not well. Do we really blame him for being uh, a creeper or whatever? Uh, I don't know. I, again, you know, oh, I got it whole rest of this video it's just the same thing he appears to be filming in like a children's room uh so that's again a little bit concerning um happy merry christmas holiday Uh, this appears to be a video where he has made the conscious decision to add in the It Is A Mystery music uh, while these rides are spinning. Uh, he, it's a conscious decision because there's multiple videos where he has added in the It Is A Mystery music. And I don't know what that's about. You would assume somebody who is as... You would assume somebody who's the way that this guy is... Uh, wouldn't, like, specifically cut in, like, a meme song? And then you have a lot of these. Where, again, he's touching a child's foot here. Holding a on obsession with shoes. Princess Peach and Rosalina and Princess Daisy. Beautiful fans. Hold on, shoes, girls. Only girls' shoes. Beautiful fans. Please do touch his modify shoes. Please, Princess Peach and Princess Daisy and Rosalina. Please, yes. Hexide Domination Pro. Uh, I, I'm being told reliably from people that I, I know uh, that he Hexide is likely a reference to the Owl House. There's a thing called Hexside. 
Uh, but he always spells it like this, as if it's like hydrogen hexide or something. Uh, so I don't know if that's what it is, but, you know, he likes one cartoon. Maybe he, maybe that's from another cartoon. I really don't know. But yeah, he has a number of those. Red patent pumps, squeaky toes, wiggling shoes, boots play. Hold on shoes, girls only. Hold, girls shoes, beautiful fans. Dominate pro! Obsession pro! Dominate pro! And I don't like the use of words like dominate and obsession uh, with this guy. What's this video like? Okay. Hello, my name is... 19 seconds and he like... Hello, I'm Michael D. Like, very strange. I don't know. It's it's strange. Obviously, the guy's not doing so great. So, I mean, it, it really goes without saying. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's just interesting trying to figure out the minds of people like this. Um, I don't it's know. Marco. His name is Marco. Uh, I done it. I did it. Is there not a saying? Yay, I got... Magic. What the fuck? Why is there no Sangi? What happened to the boys? We got a big Sangi. We need that. We need him. He goes right. He goes right there. That's good. I don't know why the boys were turned off. That's my bad. That's a failing on my part. Uh, I'm sorry. I guess I can get rid of the Jesus crying, although it does feel like it's needed. Now it's restoring. Huh. I just feel something with. I feel like conscious. I feel can't roll my arm. Hello! My name is Marco Diaz. Hello! I got restored. I got shots. It's done. Well, I think it's done. I'm gonna show you. Ah, oh, my arms. So, uh, essentially, essentially in this video, he talks about how he got the, you know, the shot. He got the, the vaccine. Which is probably why he's like this, am I right? Am, am I right? <laughs> there was a couple people in chat earlier who thought probably uh, probably actually think that. But uh, yeah, he got he got uh, he got the vaccine, and I my theory with this is his mom or caretaker or whoever basically had to convince him to get the vaccine by being like, "You're getting injected with magic or something." That's the best I can decipher from this. Um, <laughs> One minute here. There we are. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now I restore the red magic. The he told me magic. what he's going to talk about it. Now the red magic is restored. The real magic. Um, yeah, so... You know, uh, he's got he's got a YouTube that's like that. He's got a few YouTubes actually. Uh, here's here's another one, uh, and on this one apparently we have uh, we have this video here. LAPD police October fifteenth, twenty twenty one. Where uh, yeah, he's been in some way in contact with uh, the LA. I guess something that I should point out, by the way, hang on, I guess I should point this, I don't know, you might have picked up on this earlier. You may have picked up on this, it was right in front of us this whole time. But, uh, you, you remember when I showed the, the LAPD thing, the cops, where he, like, edits out the, the names of people and stuff and, and turns it into contact a guard, Luna, Twilight, Princess, fuckface. Um... Yeah, he he reposts this shit. I don't know how he gets a hold of this stuff. Maybe he finds people talking about him. But he is, like, lucid enough as a person. Whatever's wrong with him, it's not so wrong that he is not aware of people that are aware of him and not happy about him. And he he posts these to his Twitters and whatnot. People, like understandably skeeved out there's another thing that he does like you know like lolita fashion people uh on on instagram he apparently takes uh fucking hell I, i'm covering up all the super chats i'm sorry um 
He apparently takes uh, shots of like women dressed in like Lolita fashion uh, on Instagram and he crops it to just their feet. And he like photoshops a hand covering the feet. The, the shoes. Never like bare feet. It's never bare feet. It's specifically the shoes. Um... But yeah, he does this. He specifically and 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 the 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 Lolita people like they post about it. They're like block this guy and everything. Don't let him interact with you. And he will repost screen caps of them being, you know, like warning people about him. Uh and yeah, I don't know. Uh I guess I I neglected to mention that earlier, but it's worth noting because yeah, he he is aware enough of whatever he's doing and the reaction to what he's doing that he re reposts people being upset about him. So he's not entirely without, you know, like without lucidity. He's not completely pink elephants. He, he has some foundation in like other people reacting to his existence. Uh, so that's worth noting. But yeah, I guess the police... Inter they they came to his house probably at 3 a.m. Don't don't call the police at 3 a.m. And this Hello. is a video of that. Hello. Hello. Still, um, I think it's still a new, um, maybe the leader of the Russian Kingdom. And he's still, yes, he's still in Russian Kingdom. And he's, yeah, it's still something of a problem. It's still. I think of. Uh, it was the police officer. I think it's trouble. And it's Senate when we open. It's okay. It's still the Master Kingdom, the leader for me. Marcus he is a new leader. The Master Kingdom is still is still leader in the Master Kingdom. And Marcus I'm really glad that we got so much information out of this. Um yeah, I don't know. I don't know, man. Uh there's another one here. The it's same okay. day. It's okay, we prince. <laughs> It's okay, okay Who did it? Wait, it's a fa uh, function of cosplay. A girl with this wearing wearing this is very bad. She's I'm trying to decipher this. Start anything? And I, I showed the shoes on in there and they posted it and I did. This really happened. Don't worry. If it's nothing, it would be a trouble. And nothing. Just see if it's okay. It's, is still alive, but it's, it's, uh, it's, sure. Yeah, no, I, I I totally understand what you're saying. I would love an account where he just he just like it's one video. He just like lights up a cigarette. He's like, you know, I have to do this shit every day. And he's just like he's just like the legit version of himself. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hello. Oh Jesus. My name. My name is. My name is Marco Diaz. Oh, God. Yes. You can tell that's not even his real voice or anything. I'm allowed to make fun of that voice in as much as I'm allowed to make fun of anything regarding this man. Uh, but, but you can tell that's a put on voice because he talks in his normal voice and he's like, hello, 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 it's Marco Diaz, which is probably not anything like how the actual cartoon character even sounds. So that's great. My, it's me, Marco Diaz. It's me. Well... Really down. I'm sorry. It's lost. Anyway, getting the smash, but me, Marco Diaz, and Star Butterfly, Kristen the Butterfly, but Queen Eclipse uh, Butterfly, and without his. Yeah, there's nothing happening. I'm sorry. Yeah, there's nothing happening. I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay, is there anything else? I mean, in this, f like, 15-minute video, does anything happen? It, oh, yeah, I forgot. I forgot. I thought, please, can I touch it to me? Oh, I forgot. Oh, yeah. He forgot. Okay, well, that's his YouTubes. I mean, there's other there's other YouTube channels that he has, uh, but I think we're good on that. Let me... Let me take a look at his Twitters real quick. Uh, well, you know, before we look at directly at his Twitter, uh, like I always say, it's like the sun. You don't want to look directly at the Twitter. Uh, before I do that, I should point out, uh, you know, we've seen him kind of horny. We've seen him kind of flirty or charming or whatever he's trying to be. Let's let's take a look at him angry. 
Uh, this is him. This is this is him upset. Fuck you, I so stupid shit bitch motherfucker fella dick jackass I so stupid shit bitch Miriam. Is this is this sunflower Get mad about Miriam cunt Miriam? <laughs> Media bitch, uncle fucker, motherfucker, fella dick, jackass, Big Mac, fella bitch, uncle fucker, pahole, pussy, polo caca, bitch, jerk, bastard, shut the fuck up, retard, bitch, coward, cock, baka, C, CFG. We got chord progressions now. Uh, uh, just some, some, some keyboard face smashing. HD, fuck you, ugly, big fat girl, robots, girls, are ugly, coward, broken down, oxir bitch will smash the stupid, smash the break, your s robot girl's bodies, you stupid shit bitch broke, you are robot girl's bodies, break out, pick, cess, part, destroy, destroy, ever auditorium, bitch, uncle fucker, paho, paho, big mac, fella, bitch, ugly, coward, cobra, bitch, and uh, there's a uh, there's a number of these. This appears to be stuff that he sends to people on Instagram. He like sends these as quote unquote harassment. I don't know if this even counts as harassment. I mean, I feel like harassment needs to be more. I don't know, coherent than this. Uh, fuck you, Princess Beach. I so I so stupid shit, bitch, motherfucker. And I mean, it just goes on. It, it keeps going. I don't know if he has the pass. Uh, he, he's got to he got to change it to fella. Uh, fuck you all. Rarity. Fuck you, rarity. I so stupid. Shit, bitch. Fucker. Jerk. Moron. Shut the fuck up. Retard. Shit, bitch. Coward. Whoa. Uh, and yeah, he does this. Uh, this is on his Instagram. I will not be looking at his Instagram, but uh, because because fuck Instagram, honestly, I don't I don't want to have to. I don't want to have to look through that. I mean, there's more of these. Um, what is this one here? What is this? Please to touch his modify shoes. Please, Princess Peach and Princess Daisy and Rosalina and Pauline. Please, yes. Yes or no. <laughs> Do you want to have sex? Yes or no? And, uh, and then he just has this where he photoshops himself, like his hand covering the shoes of other people. I don't know if these are all cartoon characters. Some of them look like real people. Uh, but yeah, you know, that's just more of his antics. Let's look at his actual Twitters now, uh, which might be kind of hard to do because he, like I said before, he likes to, he likes to replace his Twitter, like change his handle uh, private his Twitters, deactivate his Twitters, make new Twitters. Uh, he has a bunch of Twitters under the names of different consoles. So like Edgar Neri Wii U, Edgar Neri PS3. That's his horny one, by the way, the PS3 one. Uh, let me, let me take a look here. Marco Diaz. So this is his, more or less his main, oh look, Survivor airing on CBS. That's cool. This is more or less his main Twitter. Um, and I mean, as you can see, you know, he he has he has pinned this very important tweet, uh, which has 685 views. That's not nothing. Well, it's, it's close to nothing. But uh, I'm going to have to carefully vet this as I look through it, because uh, most of his tweets are marked as potentially sensitive. And I mean, you know, most of it is just, most of it is just this, this thing where he, he photoshops his hand covering a shoe. This is what gets this man off. Can you even imagine your fucking wires being crossed so hard that like before you can come, you have to photoshop yourself putting your hand over like Princess Peach's shoes That might be one of the weirdest, because I mean, at its core, it's just a foot fetish, right? But it's such a specialized version of it. It's like if you liked, like, like, like asses, but not just asses. You like the, you like the freckles on the butthole. That's what, that's, that's the only thing that gets you going. 
That's what that's the level that this is on. It's very specific, but yeah, a lot of his tweets on this account appear to just be this, and I don't know why they're marked as potentially sensitive. I mean, ultimately they're just feet. Like here it's it's ballerina feet with his disembodied master hand looking ass hand covering up the foot. Is this like is this like cover your shame woman? Is it like is it like sent the the censorship weirdos that are that are really into like looking at censored porn because it's like I don't know some kind of cuckold denial bullshit for fucking weirdos. I I don't know. Uh for 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 yeah, I uh, maybe it's that, but it's very specialized. It's very specific. And again, you do, you know, it raises the question obviously of like is this like, I don't know. The guy is crazy. The guy is not well. So, like, this feels like whoever is in charge of this man is failing pretty hardcore. Because he's... He's just running fucking rampant. Imagine jerking off to this. Imagine putting time and effort into placing your hand, your cutout hand PNG, over this five-pixel foot. Unbelievable. Uh, potentially sensitive. It's more shoes. It's just a lot of shoes. Uh, here he's got a star versus ca character. I think this is the star one. And it looks like she has one arm. It looks like she's got a me situation going on. Because she's got this arm over here. But then it's like her, her sleeve just ends. And there doesn't appear to be an arm coming out of it. Maybe this guy's an amputees too. Solidarity, brother. Don't come near me. Uh, but, but yeah, there's that. Uh, and, I mean, there's that. Just, just the Marco Diaz character, like, hmm, hmm, I'm looking for bitches. Craning his fucking back. Uh, that's me, Marco Diaz. Look, it's him. That's definitely him. That's totally what he looks like. Uh, uh, Sora Sakurai. Oh my god. So here he is trying to get Mar petition Sakurai to put Marco Diaz in Smash Brothers. Uh, and uh, this is... Uh-huh. I'm told that this is a scene from Star vs. also. But I guess with Nintendo people. I guess there's just a lot of people that uh, jerk off to this cartoon and Mario. Like, I guess that's just there's overlap there. You know, there's enough that there's fan art of whatever this is. Uh, Super Smash Brothers 6. Marco Diaz, fighter. Star Butterfly, fighter. Crescenta Butterfly, fighter. Queen Eclipse Butterfly, fighter. Roster. Characters in Smash Bros. They are six. Um. So yeah, you know, look forward to Smash Brothers six, where we have, uh, whatever the fuck these are in in Smash. Uh, uh, there's another one here where he appears to. Oh God, look at this. He tried to, <laughs> he tried to like Google translate his uh his his deep heartfelt request for. Super Smash Bros. 6 Maruko Diaz. <laughs> he, he has to he has to put it in language that Sakurai will understand. Obviously, uh, you know you you wouldn't want to you wouldn't want Smash Six to come out and and this guy you know he doesn't get Marco Diaz and it's like ah oh, forehead I forgot to put the oh, I forgot to put it in Japanese. God damn it. You wouldn't want that to happen. Um, let me see. Uh, we have like some weird, I don't know, fetish art. Well, not even fetish art. We've got this girl dressed as Zelda from the Legend of Zelda series. This is Zelda. She's dressed as Zelda right now. And then we've got this art. I'm going to stop looking here. Uh... Uh, we got at, at Bullock Savvy. Please to touch his modify shoes. Please, Princess Peach. Please, yes. And who is this person? 
This is just some random lady. She doesn't deserve this. This lady doesn't even have Princess Peach or whatever in her fucking avatar. She's just some lady. But he's like at her about, Please, the, the shoes, the modified shoes, please, yes! Uh, oh my god, not this again. Don't bring me to Alberta. Uh, red patent pump, squeaky toe, wiggling shoes, play hexide obsession with shoes, Princess Peach and Princess Daisy and Rosalina and Pauline. Beautiful shoes, fan please to touch his modified shoes. Please, Princess Peach and Princess Daisy and Rosalina and Pauline. Please, yes. Please, for candid wiggle, wiggling pop, popping up the frumping toe feet flats all over you are bottom feet. Please, hexide obsession pro, hexide domination pro. So, you know, a lot of that, a lot of that, uh, there's, there's a lot of, there's a lot of that going on. This is this guy's, uh, uh, Twitter. And I mean, you know, we got more, we got more foot cover ups here, you know, the, the cover, covering up the truth. Uh, we really miss her princess Rosalina 2007 based Ava. And, uh, this is just a Rosalina themed Instagram account, I guess. I guess he assumes people on the internet who, whose name is Rosalina. He just assumes that they're the real Rosalina, I guess. I don't know how he rationalizes that there are like thousands of these people, but, you know, he's the real Marco Diaz, apparently. So, you know, uh, anything's possible. <clears throat> Here he is screen capping his own tweet about some moonlight luna thing i'm blocked it is done i'm sorry rosalina ain't the count bye forever and uh i don't know i guess he got blocked by this person and he or no he blocked them he blocked a pony i guess he cut all ties with pony people so that the mario people knew that he was like legit or something here's some here's some princess daisy porn that's cool um yeah uh we got this oh my god not again don't i don't care about megan markle fucking hell every time you right click or you you middle click scroll wheel on twitter you fucking risk bringing up some random shit because twitter is an awful website Good God, uh, but, but there's this, there's, there's mushroom shoes, which he has successfully covered, so that's good, uh, you know, looking at this, this is a left hand in most of these pictures, so finally I know where it went off to, so that's good, uh, but, you know, that's that Twitter, let's take a look, briefly, because, you know, we've been doing this for a little bit, we've been doing this for a little bit now, uh, I think we mostly get the gist of this. There's more. There's there's always more. But, uh... King Edgar Neri Potion Hero X uh, at Edgar Neri Wii U. Uh, again, reminder, don't get involved. Don't, don't, don't harass any of these, any people on this channel. Uh... Russian RT leadership changeling empire and China dark Houston power admitted pedophile with shoes MLP please to touch his modify shoes please please and uh, yeah some keywords in here that are of note um, dark Houston power I don't know what that's about but I assume most people are looking at uh, admitted pedophile with shoes. Uh, which, again, yes, he, he doesn't seem to have any issue with that. Uh, yeah. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, is that a kid? Hang on. What? Yeah, that's a... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, here he is with a pinned tweet about how he is a pedophile with shoes, girls, da -da 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 -da, on and on and on it goes. Uh, in this tweet where there is like a child with shoes. I don't know what more you need. I mean, again, to some extent, it's like, you know, he's crazy or whatever is up with him. He's, he's, co he's Cocoa Puffs, but uh, 
I mean, something must be done. <laughs> you know, this is this is a lot. Let me let me take a look here. Well, we got this. Uh, nice, a nice solemn moment here. You know, he's 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 thinking. He's real contemplative in this one. Um, let's see here. Here he is again. We've seen this picture in one of those WWE ones. But this it appears to be a few years ago, I would assume. I like the very, very thin, slight beard that's happening. And just, yeah, someone someone gave him the fucking Princess Luna fuck Twilight sparkly sparkle fuck uh, haircut. And it uh, looks great. It looks great. Uh, we got... We got this wonderful picture of him as a child, I guess, in which he... <laughs> I don't know. This could be an emote on the Discord. Uh, I like the lift on his hair. He's going fucking Vegeta. He's going, like, super. Uh, and, yeah, it's just pictures of him. Oh, man. Oh, how how time changes a fella. Look at that. Look at... So young and filled with... Well, actually, he still looks like he's filled with lust and, and uh, weirdness in this picture. But then, you know, you jump to this and it's like a fucking mug shot. Uh, here he is looking like he just got a new pocket protector. That was his nerd phase. And then this is just some other guy. Some random dude on fucking Instagram's brother. Some guy on Instagram has this guy as a brother. And for some reason... Edgar Neri here decided to put that into his collage of pictures of himself. I don't know, man. You fucking figure that shit out. I don't know. I do not know. Uh, we got a lady here that looks like, I don't know, possibly related to him. Please don't bring me to Will Smith news. Thank you. Yeah, and I mean, again... <laughs> Again, what is this? What relationship does he have to these children? Are they okay? Like, can something is up here? I don't know. I do not. I do not like what's. I do not like the look in his fucking eyes right here. Uh, but that's our boy. Um, and you know, there's plenty more. There's so much more. There's just porn of like I think this is Trixie Tang from Fairly Odd Parents. I don't know. It's not it's not really porn. I don't know. Which cartoon is this? Anyways, don't answer that. Uh yeah, more like selfies of him. Here he is with like blonde highlights. He's looking good. Fierce. Fuckable. Fabulous. Looking real good. He's got his headphones there. Um I want to move on, but you never know what to expect. You know, honestly, honestly, if you just, you know, you just uh, do a little of this, do a little of that. Am I the only one who sees a bit of a resemblance there? I don't know. Something about the face. It's the smile. It's That's what it is. It's the non-smile weird, like... It's like that thing. That weird face scum, whatever you call it, where it's like not a smile. It's like he has gas. It's just like... That's, that's, that's the, that's the, the, that's the, uh, the, the pedo face, I guess. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. I mean, again, there's more here. We've got, <laughs> this is one of those ones where you could just keep scrolling forever and you will keep finding things. These were all posted on this account that we're looking at right now. These were all posted in the last day. Look at this. Here he is fucking charging up his special. He's got vampire fangs and red eyes and super power lightning hands. And then you scroll down and here's just a black lady. <laughs> I mean, who's that? I don't know. I'm sure he does. Maybe he doesn't. I don't know. But he, you know, she gets a spot. 
Here's some what looks like probably pony feet or something. They got a spot. Uh, no, that's not pony. I can't tell. It's like cropped. I guess it's like stockinged feet or something. Here is, I guess, him as like a child where he looks even more out of it than he normally does. Uh, and then you have whatever this is. I'm sure someone knows what cartoon this is. It looks like Jimmy Neutron or something, but with like a chicken. I think it's Chicken Little. He really likes Chicken Little. I think that's I think that's the case. Doesn't Mr. Enter really like Chicken Little? I don't know. Uh, on that note, you know, that's, uh, that's Marco slash Edgar Neri. And I mean, again, there's just so much more you can look at here. Here... Here he is, like, face camming or face tuning himself or whatever to look like a pretty lady. Uh, beautiful. Uh, very good. There's a lot. There's so much. There's a lot. There's, 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 there's so much. Uh, there's various pictures of shoes. You know, I mean, there's other Twitters. There are other YouTubes. There are other pictures like this uh, with him with vampire fangs. And green eyes. Um, and I don't... That seems to be from one of his older Twitters from like 2013. He had a bunch of pictures that look like this. So I don't know why he still posts those. Uh, I mean, why does he post anything really? I guess I should start there. But uh, yeah, you know, we could keep going. Uh, the further I scroll, the more chance there is of me finding something hilarious. Uh... <laughs> He's just got a picture of Charlie. <laughs> Hello, everyone. It's me, Marco. Okay, we're not doing that. Hello, everybody. Thank you for watching all the way to the end. Uh, apologies for a differently shitty mic this time. Uh, this time we're using my phone uh, for various reasons. And uh, really, it's just a sliding scale of poor audio quality as, uh, as the channel goes on. Um, so that's very cool, but uh, hopefully that'll just be temporary. Um, I'd like to say a big thanks to Brent Thornton, Zach Carter, Sam Dink Dink, Cry, Patrick Foley, Andrew Koenig, James Hyphen, Boiling Guy, Alistair the Radio Demon, Jessica Shepard, Grand Admiral, Urine Fetus, Vince Bear, Baphomet Babe, Riddle of Lightning, Ares, and my top unit, my absolute boy, Xylax. Thank you very, very much. And thank you to all of my Patreon friends. Uh, I'm going to have to update the list soon once I get back to my proper computer. So this is all going to look very different next time and hopefully sound a lot better as well with uh, with my proper microphone. Um, but uh, yeah, thank you for watching to the end. And um, uh, penis, don't touch feet. Touch grass instead. <laughs>